Hello guys, it's Debbie from Debbie J's Crafting Corner and it is time for another Happy Mail Bag. Hello and welcome to Debbie J's Crafting Corner. I'm Debbie and I want to help you unlock your creative potential. Each week I show you how you can create awesome cards and other crafty projects. Because if I can make it, you can too. So if you'd like to see more tutorials and inspirational videos, be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the little bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. Hi guys and welcome back to another Happy Mail Bag. Today I'm going to be sharing all of the different Happy Mail that I received for last month. I know I'm about a week or so late. There's a couple more envelopes that I was waiting on and I decided I'm going to go ahead and go with what I've got instead of taking up more of you guys' time making you wait to see your cards on screen. Um, I like doing this so I can give a shout out to all of my buddies that are sending, um, that are participating in the swaps that I'm in. Um, this is part of the Crafting with Debbie Facebook group. We have a monthly swap and there's also a monthly swap over on the FFC, FSC Boiling Snobs Club. So if you haven't joined either of those groups, why don't you join us and um, we would love to have you. Just make sure that when you go in to join those groups, you answer all of the questions because that's going to let us know that we can go ahead and get you approved and that you're not a robot. Anyway, the first one that I have is from my friend Denise Hill and let me get that opened up and we will see what we have here and this was part of the um, the crafting with Debbie Facebook group swap oh my goodness that is so cute she's been doing these um, I forgot what it's called, but she's making all of these. I mean, she even did quilling on there. I've done quilling once, and I have not been willing to give that one another shot. And it looks like she's got some hand lettering on here, too. I think all of this is done freehand, not stamps. So she did an awesome job on that. And look at those cute little eggs. Oh, my goodness. And then she did quilling on the inside as well. Great job, Miss Denise. Thank you so much, honey. So that one is the first one, and then she signed the back of it, signed with love and the date. That is awesome. I love that little bunny. Oh my goodness. That is just too cute. Um, the second one is from Maylin, and this is again someone from the Crafting with Debbie group. Let me see if I can get this open without hurting anything. I'm always afraid I'm going to cut into the card. I think this may be an, a handmade envelope too because it's nice and sturdy. Okay, let's see. And on the front, it, I see that it's stamped with a little Pooh Bear, so not surprising that the card has Winnie the Pooh on there too. I just have to get it out of the envelope. Oh, that is just cute. I mean, it's not exactly Winnie the Pooh, but it is. It's still poo. And then she's got the little um, honeycomb. And then this is dripping with honey. Oh, my goodness. Assuming that those are some stencils, which now I need. And I'm going to have to find out from you, Miss Malin, what stencils those are. Oh, that is adorable. Happy spring, and thanks for being a swap partner. Thank you so much, honey. I love that card. That is just too cute. And then this next, I'm go ahead and just put these, lay them out so you can see them. Okay, so the third card, this one is from Ms. Um, Jeannie Ellis. She is scrapbooking mama over here on YouTube. So let me go ahead and get that one opened up. Oh, and hers is a shaker. That is precious. We've got all the little Easter eggs and he is risen and Easter blessings. That is precious. Thank you so much, Miss Jeannie. Next, we've got a, a package from Miss Gala. 
And this one's going to need scissors to open it, I do believe. Especially if I don't want to hurt anything that's on the inside. <laughs> so for, she's got it in an envelope and then she's got it also in a bubble wrap envelope. Actually, she did what I do. She used leftovers, which recycling is always good. Oh, this is cute. So I'm going to be gentle with this. So she left the inside blank so that I can can use it. And it looks like she's got a bunch of things to... She's got a bunch of ephemera and stuff to go with it. Let me just make sure everything is out of there. So this is kind of like a little pocket on the front of her card. I have not done pockets on the front of her card yet. And then she gave me a, some cut aparts. What shaken, pretty butterfly, some succulents, a telephone, live simply, a nice pretty flower, and remember this. Thank you so much, and that was very sweet of you. And this also, it's on the back of a cut apart or note was, so that could also be used on another card. So let me tuck those back in that little envelope. <coughs> so next we've got, let me just double check my list real quick. Okay, and Camille is also going to be one from the foiling snot from the Crafting with Debbie group. And then we will start on the Foiling Snobs Club. I don't want to rip this. And since it's a long envelope, you can tell this is gonna be a slim line. Oh my goodness, that is so cute! And I think I've seen the stamps too, but I don't have them yet. You guys know I don't really have any eggs. And these are just so cute. And that bunny is adorable. Oh, I love that. And then she has stamped it on the back as well. Okay, so those, those are all the ones from the Crafting with Debbie Facebook groups. So and now we're going to start on the Foiling Snobs Club. So this first one is from Cindy. Oh, and it looks like she did a wax seal on the back as well. Do you guys see that? It says, best wishes. And I've got some wax seals, so I need to start using some of those. Got some ideas as to how to use them on cards, so I'll have to do that at some point. So now, let's get this open. Ooh. So it looks like she did um, some holographic foil over this um, sunflower and then to celebrate. That is lovely. So the theme for the Foiling Snob Clubs was, one of the themes was celebrate, so that looked perfect for that. And I love, love, love this one. It looks like it was probably done with hot foil and it looks, it looks just lovely. The next one we have is from Linnea. So let's see if I can get that one open. I am just having trouble with these envelopes today. Okay. Ooh, that is real pretty too. Look at that. She's got glitter and so it's mostly glitter. I was thinking maybe foil too, but this this is definitely got dimension on that sentiment. Oh, and it's one of the cards that I really this this is a fun fold card that I have never tried this design. I'm going to have to analyze this without tearing it apart <laughs> because I want to do one. So it was a celebrate or congratulatory. Um, theme for last month's hops I mean last month's swap so this is perfect look at all that glitter 
and it says we are so proud of you and this the sentiment frame is is foiled and then there's glitter on the letters oh I just love that I am definitely going to be copying that and then she gave me a little note that's why I was reading this down. I was thinking that these were foilables, and that's what they are. These little pieces are all foilables, so I can run those through my laminator and foil them up and add them to some cards. So we've got Life in Full Bloom. Don't stumble over something behind you. Makes a lot of sense. A little wish for you. <laughs> Unicorn Mermaid Princess. It doesn't matter. You're something special. I love that. That is too cute. This one is good for a background, so it's kind of got that... Um, mesh like screen or or um, wire grid that is too, too cool oh she gave me two of the unicorn mermaid princess ones that is too sweet thank you so much and that was Linnea I believe that was Linnea yes thank you Linnea appreciate it honey and now I have to have to put that one's going over with the envelope so I don't lose everything Okay, next we have a card from Pat. Handcrafted by Pat. Oh, that is a pretty foiled horse. That is lovely. And it says, congratulations down at the bottom, and you did it, way to go. This is done in embossing. So the congratulations and the inside sentiment are both embossed, and then the horse is foiled, and then she's got some enamel dots that she added as well. That is nice. I like that. I don't think there's any of them that I don't like, so anyway. Uh, the next card we have is from Brooke. <laughs> Life's a cam life is like a camera and then it says pull here so you pull that and that's where a picture would be that is too cute and I think the reason that she left that blank is because she wants me to be able to use it oh that's cool she's got on the inside focus on what's important capture the good times develop from the negatives and if things don't work out take another shot and then I've got this, which is, a, I think it might be a sticker. Actually, I think, no, it's a, fo a foiled sentiment of a camera. That is awesome. <coughs> that is such a neat idea. I'm going to have to try that too. Oh my goodness. Okay, the last one that I have here is actually not from one of this one of the swaps on one of the groups. It's from Marla Harris, and we decided to do a swap when we did our collaboration for the Easter um, the the Easter card video that we did on um, last month. So let me go ahead and open up what I've got from Marla. And it looks like this is from a die that perforates the top. That is kind of interesting. Oh, that is too cute. And I want that die set, and I haven't gotten it yet. This is one that will work really well. This die set will work really well with the um, Magic Iris, that circle. But that is just lovely. She's got a little cute little bunny down here and some Easter eggs and that little bird. I love that. That is too pretty. That is just too sweet. Thank you so much, Marla. Actually, thank you so much to all of the ladies that um, decided to swap with me this month. I love all of these cards. It's just fantastic. And you guys are just so creative, which is one reason why I want to share all of the things that you are making with the rest of the world so that, you know, they can see it and be inspired as well. So thank you again, and I really appreciate you swapping with me. Let me go ahead and just spread some of these out one more time so you can take one more quick look. There we go. That's a little bit better. Now we can see pretty much everything. This is just 
these are wonderful thank you guys i really appreciate it and thank you for to everyone for watching and dropping in with me as i opened up my happy mail for this month you guys have a wonderful day and remember if we can make it you can too until next time